this is Exploring with Emma and Stu. I'm Em. And I'm Stu. And today we are here in Essex at Hampford Water Nature Reserve uh, to basically have a bit of a day walk. Yeah. And while we're here, we're going to explore a few things for you, um, hopefully a lime kiln, as well as some abandoned boats that are down here. Yeah. Uh, we're going to show you, we've come across the lime kiln, so if you'd like to come with us. And this is the lime kiln, which is pretty cool. Right, so we assume it's like Victoria or something, don't we? Oh yeah, definitely. I'm just going to... Go down it. So I'm actually messing around with the the uh, the actual things at the moment, which is really quite incredible. So if you'd like to come down here, so with the DJI, um, it allows me to to have better light without actually having a light yeah. on. Because it's actually fairly dark. Isn't it? it is very dark. Yeah, it's actually. I mean, it's struggling, but it will do okay. So if Emma likes to put a, a light on, yeah, you got a light on. So this is basically just a round structure. Oh, it stinks of weed in here though. But the kilns, obviously they'd have put lime and coal in the top of this. We'll show you the top in a bit. Yeah. And then when it had done, they'd pull it out, stick it in a cart and it'd be out the door. There's no actual evidence of lime being around here again though, is there? Because they just clear it all out. No, but we're near a long dock. So yeah, we're, we're going to show you that. This is quite cool, a big vaulted ceiling, I guess. Yeah, another vaulted ceiling. It's a bit like a bit Martello-y, isn't it? Oh, yeah, it's definitely really cool. very Martello-y. But, um, yeah, maybe that's one of the hatchways they've pulled some of it out. Yeah. Get something in we there. We don't know too much about these. We're not going to pretend that we No, exactly. How's that light getting on? Because right. I just need a bit of focus on the light. Got another, another part that's there. The, uh, like, they're giving it a poke. Just yeah. Stoked it. <laughs> but I must admit, I think the DJI is actually keeping this really well done, actually, Emma. It was a bit uneven. Oh, it's completely uneven, but look at that amazing brickwork. Absolutely. There's amazing. loads of these about, isn't there? Quite oh, a lot in Norfolk. Course. We're going to explore some in Norfolk soon. Yeah. Right? So. And there's the third arm or something, isn't that? Uh, that is oh, don't know, that. Maybe that had a cap on it originally. Looks like that goes up. To, up. There's a little mound on this. We'll have yeah. to go up there. We'll have to look and have a look. We'll keep the camera going, though. But I think that the DJI actually uh, done quite well there. So we go up the stairs here. And then we go up to the mounds, this is all our, our, our equipment. <laughs> and this is, we're going to give you a nice little view of that in a minute. So yeah. This is Hanford Waters, you've got just walk on the nose over there. Just over there. So if we come up here, we should, ah, here we go. This is the top where the funnel would have been, uh, well, uh, the oven. The lime. Oh, the lime into this. It would have been layers, lime coal, lime kiln, coal. And they'd obviously have burnt it and until it turned into quick lime, I suppose. Yeah. And then we've got some sort of structure just yeah, here. But we don't really know what it is. No. But it is quite old if you look at the wall. Yeah. Maybe it was something originally to do with this because it's very similar sort of bricks. It's very similar brickwork, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't know. It looks, we, we believe it looks older than um, war. Yeah, I don't, I personally don't think it's war. No. No, uh, I don't probably actually. Probably storage or something. Along them lines, but, I reckon. Yeah, you've got a lovely view up here, though. Let's have a look at the view. Look at this, look. Very nice. It's a nice day. We've very had some rubbish rub, rubbish weather just lately, haven't we? So quite yeah, today. very nice. Okay, then, uh, we're going to switch the camera off and we're going to have a look at the boat in a minute. Yes. See you in a second. Right, okay. We've come across the boat. We've just had a look at it, as you can see in the footage. We've not spoken much. Um, no, well, we've just walked, what, I don't know, half a mile yeah. down from where were we? Where we were. I have no idea. No, and we've come across these, so we thought we'll have a look. We're going to see if we can maybe get onto this one. Yeah, um, um, don't know. we'll see. <laughs> uh, it, we're trying to get to use the drone, but the, the wind is so powerful today. We've, we've, we've levitated it, um, but the wind is really strong and it still will take yeah, it. We're not really very brave, are we? No, not brave at all. So, um, well, let's get onto the... Yeah, uh, see, if, see if we can get onto this boat, or one of us at least. Exactly. Probably me. So this is what we've just clambered through. And Emma's up there, so I'm gonna pass the phone over to her so she can start doing some recording. All right, well, there isn't really much to see. Um, I'll come back here a little bit. So this is the top of the boat, stable enough. I'm just gonna pop my head in here, <laughs> see, if, uh, see if there's anything worth seeing. I'm trying to be really careful because this boat is obviously very old. Um, I'm going to grab a torch actually. Yeah, it's probably a good idea. Just in case. No, don't know where my torch is. Never mind. 
Right, so little, little steps here. And this just looks like a little seating area that they've they've made. Oh, little table. Uh, don't know what it's. Ow, that's my head. <laughs> I always do my head in, don't I? What is that? A little light or something, possibly. Some random mirror. Um, anyway, so I'm not going to be able to get down here. These are the steps I've just come up. But because there's no there's no way, and as you can see, it's flooded. But yeah, this is. Is the boat. We'll, we'll look through the side window as well. Look at these little curtains, look. They're quite sweet. Yeah, this is just so rotten. There's a little doorway through here that goes through to another compartment. Um, but I'm, I'm not even going to try to get down there. It's all wet. I haven't brought my wellies. It's all bottles or something. Oh, well, there you go. God knows how long this has been sat here for. But would have made nice. What an amazing nice little boat once. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to come back up these steps and I'll pass you back over at Stu and then we'll have a little look inside oh, one of the I'll windows. The yeah. Alright, there All right. you go. Okay, my hand's in the way of the camera. Okay, so we'll have a quick look. Looks like we've got another sink. This looks like a living room area, kitchen area. This looks like a heater, as you can see there. And some bits that you can't actually get to. Looks like there's a stairwell up there ready to come down to the back end of the boat, maybe a bedroom. But yeah, and you've even got the plug in there still, which is pretty cool in the curtains. So yeah. And Emma's just found her torch. But I'm going to turn the camera off for a second and let Emma come down. Catch you in the next one. Catch you next time. Right, thanks for watching. Bye.